We are on our way to Hermanus once again. Um, our cousins are down from Belgium, Sebastian and uh, Clarissa with their little boy. So as a family we're going to go and visit them. Um, we're going to spend the day in Hermanus and uh, yeah, we're going to do a little bit of touring again in Hermanus. Let's see if we can pick up a few more different places. So yes to creating more memories once again. So morning everybody! Morning. Hi! 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 <laughs> So we just pulled over in Stanford, um, we wanted to come for a quick cup of coffee while we're waiting for our cousins to make it to Hermanus and uh, they've got an incredible little coffee shop here called The O Meal, it's right next to the big circle as you get into the main part of Stanford and uh, they've got a great little kiddies play area so the girls are going to draw a little bit there and just work themselves out until they see their cousins so yeah we'll share with you what we're going to have in a minute Enjoy. Give me your hand. I'll come and push you. Okay, so I just wanted to show you guys uh, around in the restaurant. They've got their own little bakery here, and they've got such incredible breads. So just have a look at this. So as far as I understand, they bake them daily. Really fantastic. So just some more of their delicious goodies. Check this out. Oh. My wife's going to kill me. I want to buy all of this stuff. Except they've got their own bakery. They start from making great stuff. So yeah, if you're going through Stanford, you absolutely have to stop at uh, O'Meal and come and check out what they've got here. Their restaurant is fantastic. Their staff are super friendly and helpful. So yeah, check it out. Let's go. Where are you guys going? Slap Chippy, the track is turning, don't fall off Lily. I'm holding on to Are you plowing the land? What are you doing? What are we we plowing the land to sow the seed? If your name is Jordan, have a big thumbs up and hi. <laughs> okay, thumbs up and hi. <laughs> yeah, so I just wanted to chat to you guys about uh, what's been happening over the last few days. I mean, obviously, you know, for the family, we had anticipated that we were going to leave last Tuesday, but uh, there's been some delays with uh, our visas with INZ. Obviously, my um, ITA was approved and uh, you know that was pretty straightforward but I wasn't keen to leave the, the girls here at home so we're just waiting for everything to come through which should happen during the course of this week so we're really excited for it to come through but in the interim we, we have the privilege of staying with the, my mom and dad for a couple of days till we leave and uh, in doing so we're also obviously going to be touring and visiting with them. Yeah as I'd said Earlier we back in Hermanus again. You know the last time we came I found this little spot that does leather work. The guy that owns its name is Lazarus. I'll share some of his details uh, down below in the comment section. Yeah man I have been hunting for just almost a year for a proper leather shaving pouch. You know something that's you've know, got a high-end quality leather that's soft. You know it's not easy to find and you know the stuff that you do find is really overpriced and just the quality that it's made with isn't that fantastic so you know we were sitting here having burgers uh, the last time and i actually found lazarus so susie actually physically brought her belt to him and he's going to use that to recreate the same product but with a much better leather lazarus what is the name of your business lazarus leatherworks lazarus leatherworks and tell me can they find you on Facebook as well, eh? You can find me in, on Facebook as well, yes. Okay, super. Great, thanks Lazarus. Check him out. We just waited around a little bit for Lazarus to finish up uh, Susie's 
uh, belt and he actually did such an incredible job um, that Susie's so stoked and it was only 150 bucks so check it out I love it <laughs> we're gonna go meet my gran my aunt and my cousins uh, we're just taking a walk through to the Belgian restaurant uh, yeah just checking out everybody chilling having something to eat and drink out in these cafes it's incredibly beautiful yeah so check that out look how beautiful the water looks so it's a little bit breezy today but thank goodness it's not windy you know it's typically very windy in this area but uh, we're in autumn so it's a great day in Hermanus now and we're about to meet there we go What do you think of your drink? Your cappuccino? Lekker. Is it lekker? Yeah, that's yeah, nice. Who put it? Lekker. Say for the camera. And, and how are you from South Africa? Yeah. Okay. Hello. Where are you here? Where are you here? One, two. So we're just moving to another restaurant. We just had some coffees and some cool drinks at uh, the Belgian cafe. So, uh, yeah, everybody's just uh, milling around. But uh, check out this great uh, frame with grand kids. I think we're gonna take a like a family photo quickly. So I'm in a very famous part of Hermanus, or I wouldn't say famous, like more of a popular part of Hermanus. In reality, Hermanus is kind of known for being super expensive when you find places to eat. So being a family and loving to travel and uh, find affordable places for families to go, um, I just wanted to share with you where we're going for lunch. They're really affordable. They've got lacquer burgers, toasted samis, and uh, it's actually two restaurants that are combined. But uh, the one that we like to go to is Groove Cafe. So I just want to show you around here. Huh? I mean, like it's a very lucky little lunch spot. But check out the lucky cakes and stuff that they've got on to offer here. So if you're looking for a great spot to go and have something to eat for lunch with the family, check them out. So that brings us uh, to the end of our trip. Got to spend some time with. Oma, Oma's 95 this year. Um, yeah, it was a lacquer lunch. We had burgers and chips and uh, smoothies, and it was very lacquer. The kids got to play with their cousin from Belgium. And um, yeah, now we've got to go do some shopping at the Woolies to get some food stuff, and then off back to Napier for a, it's about a 40 minute drive. So, looking forward to it. <laughs> 